Hello, I'm IBX Toycat, and today I'm going to be giving you guys a feature preview for the Cold Block, which is one of the features coming in the next update for Minecraft Xbox and Minecraft PlayStation that we actually just had confirmed in the screenshot that 4J tweeted out yesterday, which showed us, uh, you know, the Cold Block actually being in the game. But honestly, if you just look at the Cold Block from that screenshot, it doesn't seem too exciting. And honestly, just look at it right here, it doesn't actually seem crazy exciting just at a first glance and knowing what it's called. Uh, but to be totally honest with you, it is one of the more kind of underrated features that once you understand, you'll think, oh, that's kind of cool, and uh, maybe like me, if you mine a lot, you'll be excited for this. So, I'm going to explain what it does, uh, you know, what it actually meant, meant for, how it looks, and, you know, designs and stuff, and also just how to craft it, all that sort of stuff. Uh, I'm going to be using PC gameplay, of course, like with all my feature previews, because then I can use gameplay to show you, rather than just talking over a screenshot. Hopefully you enjoyed that, uh, if you do, please do like the video, and also, um, let me know what you want to see a feature preview of next, because I'm considering the wither, but uh, if you have any better ideas, then let me know. So, let's get straight into it with uh, the first little fact you might not know, which is actually that coal is is the most common ore in the world and uh, in addition to being a really really common ore you actually find it in groups of 10, 20, sometimes even 30 or more ores which uh, you know sounds great because coal is pretty useful it makes torches and uh, it's used for smelting but if you do a lot of mining like you know a lot of people that are looking for diamonds and stuff you end up with so much coal in your inventory like I have 42 coal already and uh, you know you just can't find a use for it all so this is where the coal block comes in because uh, the coal block is kind of meant to be this uh, like alternative to just having lots and lots of stacks of coal because basically how it's crafted it is nine coal in a block like this kind of like a diamond block a gold block or a redstone block uh, and basically this is very very useful because you know it compacts your coal down and uh, in addition to just compacting your coal down when it comes to actually smelting uh, the each individual block of coal can smelt 80 separate items of course you only get 64 in a stack so you have to keep on pouring items in there with a hopper if you want or you can just keep throwing them in your, there yourself uh, but yeah it's still a pretty cool thing that uh, you can basically get an entire stack and even more uh, smelted with a single coal block. That was a stack of coal, now it's just 63. Uh, so yeah, I figured that was pretty cool and worth mentioning. You can get 64 stacks of stakes, even more, um, or 80 stacks of stakes, I guess, uh, just actually cooked with one stack of coal blocks. Uh, and another interesting little fact is that if you were to fill this up with coal blocks and keep pouring stuff in there with a hopper, it would take 14 hours to use up an entire stack of this. So yeah, blocks of coal are seriously good when it comes to smelting. But, you know, just being a cool way to store your coal uh, and, you know, like this, and being a cool way to smell isn't its only purpose, I mean if you don't really care about those things, uh, it also makes for a pretty funky block, so if you look at the black wool here, I'm using it in the background here it's kind of a drab, not very strong texture, the same strip of the red uh, wool um, but if you look at the redstone blocks and the coal blocks, as you can see here they're really really powerful colours, like if you just look at these combined here, uh, you can really create some interesting things here, and although you have to watch out for the redstone current the redstone block, and uh, the coal blocks are pretty hard to get, they still make some really cool stuff that make a different black that you can get anywhere else. It's not like black hardened clay, it's not like black wool. It's this really unique block that honestly some builders you know, it might be the perfect thing for what you're looking for and I think that's something a lot of people overlook. Like you can use it to build whatever you want and of course, that's a really cool thing. So, uh, that's what the coal block does in uh, Minecraft console. It's going to be a really cool way to store your coal. It's going to be a really cool way to smell even more if, you're, if you've got hoppers there. And it's also a really cool block for building. So, I hope you enjoyed this little feature preview. It's a short one because the coal block is just, you know, a block of coal. But it's still one of my, you know, more excited features for Tile Update 19. Let me know what you want to see in the next feature preview in the comments down below. As I said, like it if you like it. Share it if you really liked it. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys later for the Get Block podcast. I, I swear, it's actually uploading this time. So thank you for watching and goodbye.